So I just picked up this collector's edition for Quake Champions, which is exclusive to GameStop if you're in the US or EB Games if you're overseas. Uh, the game itself is free to play, but the collector's edition comes with this 12-inch hand-painted PVC scale bearer statue along with the champion's pack code, which unlocks additional characters that you would otherwise have to grind for. Someone in my Discord informed me that this was on sale for 50% off the original $80 price tag, which is a hell of a deal considering that's currently the same price as the champion's pack by itself. And while I haven't really followed the series since the first few games back in the mid-90s, as I generally prefer campaign over multiplayer, I decided to go ahead and pick this up as it's one of those franchises that, despite its popularity, doesn't really have a lot of merchandise to choose from. And Doom was more or less the same way until the 2016 reboot came out, and since then we've been seeing a lot more stuff. So who knows what else might be in store for the future. In fact, as I'm editing this video, Gaming Heads just teased a new Quake statue to be revealed very soon, so that's pretty cool. So here's a quick look at the instructions. Um, again, it doesn't come with the game itself, but it does come with two codes, one for the exclusive Scale Bearer skin and also for the Champion Pack code. The gun just has a peg that plugs right into his hands. The statue has some nice weight to it, pretty good detail. Um, looks really nice sitting on the desk, I'm quite impressed with it. Even though I, I haven't been able to get the game to work on my platform, I run Linux, um, but I'm still impressed with the statue. It's a franchise that I'm fond of, so I think it's a, still neat to have. Do a little 360 here so you can get a better look at the details up close. I also have the Rosaris figures um, from Quake 2. I don't, I don't think Rosaris is around anymore, but they produced the Iron Maiden and Athena. The Major and Psycho, which was exclu a previews exclusive. and also the tank figure. I would love to see the release of the original Quake OST scored by Nine Inch Nails, which is my favorite band of all time, but the page for the vinyl has said coming soon for going on two years now, and Trent won't answer my tweets. So since I can't get the game running on Linux, um, I figured I'd show you the official trailer here, um, released by Bethesda, specifically for the Scale Bear, which just shows um, a few of his moves and you can get an idea of what he looks like in-game. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, I don't really think that it's worth the original price at $80. That's a little bit much, but for if you can grab one for 50% off like I did, I think it's a nice value. That's all I got. Thanks for watching.
Okay, so the uh, 